With the parts back together, it can be seen how the parts work to cause lockup. With one wheel spinning, the cam side gear rotates relative to the case. This causes the engagement mechanism to rotate at a higher speed. At a given speed, the flyweights will swing out and engage the pawl on the lockout mechanism. This action creates a force to be exerted on the cam plate that causes it to rotate out of the detent position and into the ramping position. The active friction disc engages, which causes the cam to self-energize until enough torque is developed between the wheels to lock them together. With the wheels locked together, maximum driveline torque is available to the high traction wheel.